Hey guys, this is Kidrop speaking and today we are back in Pro Cycling Manager 2019 with our parallel playthrough of the Tour de France 2019. Stage number 7 is a massive transitional stage and it is 231.6 kilometers long. Mostly flat, there are a few little climbs here and there, nothing major, just in total 4 points to grab. Well, five if you count that additional one there um but certainly the finish or rather the last 100 kilometers are pretty easy going and we are looking for some of the depending on how the day goes of course some of the big stamina sprinters to take the win well how about fun art for instance that that kind of fits the bill here doesn't it our team overall is doing pretty well. Vincenzo Nibale is in second place. And Garcia Cortina. Ivan. He is no longer holding every single jersey. That was quite something. Well, worked out well for him. But now, now he's demoted to just being a little helper. And Vincenzo Nibale is feeling great now that he is doing so well in the overall standings. And um, yeah and everyone is slightly hammered after stage number six which was not easy oh man it's raining too well that is oh wow nibal is having a great day holy shit he's having a great day that is not quite necessary on a stage like this ron dennis too what's going on with you guys this is awesome oh and colbrelli too uh, he has a good day and it actually matters because today is sprinter day and and just a few little obstacles how is um ivan doing well well green jersey wearer we do have that little um that little sprint in just 197 kilometers from here would you like to start getting there now maybe maybe oh it looks like some attacks are going you need to try and get into the wheels there we go yes yes come on stay with them stay with them that was a solid attack it doesn't look like they are reacting so so far so good and now it looks like they have slightly woken up and yeah 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 they're chasing down some more attackers that are trying to to catch up They don't quite like that we are that there are ten riders who are trying to get to us. Now we finally got over two minutes distance and things have settled down a little. It's good to hear. We are getting closer to the um, to the first climb of the day. In total, we can only grab four points today. So we yeah we are missing ten points in order to get into back into the uh, polka dot jersey. And, and no, that's of course not going to happen today. All right, we're getting closer to the mountain rating. Let's see, are they, are they attacking? Are they going? Nope, so far, so clean. Uh, we are going to follow Roux because he's the strongest of them. Uh, he has pretty good hill stat and is a bit of a sprinter too, uh, just like Ivan here. Okay, now they're going kilometer mark. And is that even Whoa, trying properly? Let's see if we can't go out to the side a little. Come on. Oh, we got you blocked. Holy shit, we got so blocked. Okay, that's that point gone. Probably wouldn't have been quite fast enough to beat them. But um, yeah, that was a nice block, guys. It's now five minutes on the clock. In between, the, uh, whenever the peloton accelerates a little, it's j just instantly cut away 30 seconds of the lead. Alright. Let's go a little harder now. Let's go a little harder. About 85. Getting prepared. Who's on my rear wheel? Uh, yeah, he's not all that strong. I think this time around we're trying to lead it from the front. Let's go into our using our hill stat here. 95. Still efficient. Let's see. Attack, attack, attack. Go, go, go. Accelerate. Accelerate, man. Accelerate. Oh, he's... Oh. Uh, only one point. 
Damn it, they are strong. Alright, attack is going for the next climb. The 800 meters left to go. They're sprinting. Oh man, who is so strong. So damn strong. Oh, but this time around we took it. Oh, this had a flatter top. So more of the sprint actually counted. Well, there we go. Got that point. Hashtag worth it. Oh shit. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Colbrelli. Um, you need to go, mate. You need to go. Oh, okay. He was going. Very good. He had a puncture. And now he's back. Without help. So that was good. Just accelerated real quick. Only 2.50 on the clock. And we have 40 kilometers left to go until the sprint rating. That is the one I'm aiming for here. The Mount Jersey is way, way too far off for our uh, all jersey wearer, Ivan. Just 10 kilometers left to the sprint, and we have still 1 minute 30. I think that should be enough. I don't think they will be chasing quite that hard. Oh. He's going already? What? That makes little sense. Okay, well, if he wants to attack that way, we, we can continue and go with him. Yes. Oh, he's going pretty hard. Alright, I'm trying to follow Ru instead. And we have two kilometers left to go. Two kilometers left to go. I have his wheel. One kilometer left to go. It looks like he's accelerating now. And... Hmm. Yeah, he's accelerating. And he's not looking too good. So let's go. Sprint, sprint, sprint. Accelerate. Whoa! Okay. I think we take it from here. <laughs> nice. Uh, that was solid. Oh, he's attacking instead. Holy shit. Didn't see that one coming. And... Let's, let's do some lead work instead. Let's get him back. Oh, what happened here? Holy shit! All our guys! All our guys are in, in an escape group. <laughs> nice. Oh, oh, wait a second. Uh, well, that could actually be... Uh, kind of a chance if that gap keeps growing, but... No! 27 seconds so far. No, it looks like they're waiting and they are attacking basically to get get back. That was a rep in the peloton at the correct spot. Well, okay, this breakaway looks uh, extremely doomed. There's nothing more to gain here. Like th these guys don't want to ride. If if you have that kind of range, 61 to 71, when the peloton has almost caught you, yeah, there's no chance of succeeding. So I I just just hang in there. Let let you guys ride. Or you die together with me. Yeah, absolutely no will in this <laughs> in this group left. Oh, uh, what a tragedy! Well, this is not the best weather weather for some sprinting. That's for sure. Um, we are going to set up our train, our very short train, very shortly, and that will be uh, Nibali following Colbrelli. And who's leading out? Uh, Colbrelli is following Ron Dennis? I mean, you can't be much faster than him in the flat. But he's more of a uh, kilometer 5 to 3 rider. But I want to keep the train short and sweet. So let's get into position with Ron Dennis. And that should be fine that way. Oh, what are you guys doing? Don't fall back too far, eh? Ah, uh, well, I mean, he's the better sprinter. He has a bad day, but he is the better sprinter. So let me reconsider here. Colbrelli, you follow him instead. Oh, oh, there was a rip. Holy shit, there was a rip. Uh, they are not going to come back. Whoa. The, no, the green jersey's in there. Oh, wait a second. We are the green jersey. <laughs> and we're not going to partake in the sprint anyway. Uh, okay, well, that was a split. And no one here looks like... Well, oh, Bernal wants to ride. Oh, shit. There are some favorites caught out in this. Well, he's not necessarily a favorite, but he's he's up there. Look at this gap. Wow. Okay, that was unfortunate for him. We need to make sure to stay up there, though. All right, we're moving into a better position. 
That was hard work, though, to get there. Seven kilometers. The gap is still not being closed. 43 seconds. It's hovering about at the same. Okay. This is hard work up front. There's not much of a lead out left in him afterwards, but he's getting us into position. So, uh, we should have activated his bar earlier, actually. Um, 5.5 kilometers left. Nibali doesn't really need to sprint. He needs to stay with us. So let's activate his one as well. And five kilometer mark. Now let's activate yours. So a few corners. Let's check out the map just to make sure that we are playing this correctly. Oh. Oh. Okay. So the finish is exactly there. It looks like a big swooping corner here. Uh, towards the line and there are these two bends still in there at about two kilometers away from the finish so at that point we need to be in a good spot Nibali is now active so he will he will survive so one corner there comes the sharp one yes we are in a good spot here we're in a very good spot here come on Nibali hang in there you're getting uh, getting away a little too much um, he now needs to move at 99. Let's go, let's go. Hang in there. Nibali, come on, join me, join me. You need to sprint. Sprint, 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 sprint. And Colbrelli, yes. This is looking good. He's a little too slow for you. So I think you actually need to sprint now. And you need to move out of the way. Okay, there we go. You can block someone else. There, yes, block, block, block. Ah, yes, perfect. Who did we block? Uh, okay. <laughs> well, it, it, we would probably would have gotten the win anyway. This was just too solid a lead out. But uh, that was quite nice. <laughs> that reminds me of the the extreme sportsmanship of Dicky McSpeck. <laughs> uh, but uh, Colbrelli did have that. I mean, he had the the best lead out. And oh. Nibali takes second place! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Sprint Master Nibali! We took the 1 2 with a sprinter and a non sprinter. And 1 2 3! Oh man! Okay, though, his, his blocking was not what made us win. That was weak, man. That was weak. Oh, he has pretty low stamina. Okay, hmm. And. Yeah, the flat rating was a little low too, but uh, that was that was a good performance for our team. And yeah, they had. I, I now I'm kind of regretting that I blocked him because this would have been basically the same outcome. Maybe he would have been third instead. Probably would have been third instead. But yeah, that was good. <laughs> In the general, we are now just one minute twenty-one back. Because we got bonus seconds. <laughs> bonus seconds in the sprint. And we are at 22 points here in the um, under 25s. Well, yeah, let's not talk about that too much. Um, but yeah, this is the main thing. Garen Thomas still riding away in front of us. And we don't have much chances of getting him. Unless we have race day conditions like today. Oh, yeah, that's right. He had massive race day condition today, so... Yeah, otherwise, he wouldn't have been able to follow that sprint. Um, all right, let's take a look at the upcoming stage. Holy shit. Yes. Ouchies. Ouchies. This is very, very hilly. Uh, not even only hilly, but also, could say, a little mountainous. Uh, not an easy stage whatsoever. 200 kilometers long. Bit of a puncher finish. And that will be interesting. Our uh, recovery is holding up still. But, yeah, it's getting tense. It's getting tense. All right. I hope you enjoyed. And see you guys next time. <laughs>